but, uh... Oh, yeah, that's right. The Legend of Heroes stuff is, like, has multiple different, uh... Different stuff, but Legend of Heroes Trails series, the Trails series are all connected. So, like, Trails in the Sky, Trails, Cold Steel, uh, Cold Steel, etc. Are, like, all, all put together. I wanted to try and get that crit, and I didn't get it. I'm gonna try again right here. Crit! Let's go. So, for Legend of Heroes, like, you kind of have to pay attention to the, like, subheading after that of, like, if it's a Trails game or not. All the Trails games are, like, really connected. Yeah, people in chat can answer you better than me. They've played multiple games. This is my first time playing the first Trails game. This is the first Trails game. There were Legend of Heroes games before this, but I want to play the Trails series is what I care about, so... This is the first in the Trails series. That's that's the one that matters. Where's that big thing again? Where's this turtle? Where's this dang turtle at? Amberl Tower, beware of monsters. Is that the optional tower you were telling me about, chat? Valeria Lakeshore, further this way. Oh, hello. A large monster is prowling around. Are you the turtle? Is that, is that a sea turtle inside all of that nonsense? Hello. There are a lot of you. I was looking at chat for a second. Yeah, is the amber turtle all right? Really weak to fire. It's a good thing that like three of my dudes can use fire now. Well, you go ahead and like, there's so many of them. Hit that one with like a soul blur. The rest of you are fire bolting as the day is long. I don't know if any of them will die to a single fire bolt or not. Holy cow, there are so many of them. Ow. Hit that one, I guess. Alright, we're gonna have Shara's ult after she casts Firebolt. Ooh, we're gonna get a crit ult with the... Uh... Do I want to steal that, that crit for Shara's ult? Or do I want to have him crit the Firebolt? I actually don't know what would be better. Probably critting the ult would be best. Okay, a single does not kill. So I think I ult here, right? Yeah. Who is not getting aimed at with magic? Oh, crud. I don't know which one of them is getting hit by his magic attack. This one. <laughs> Get him. Ba, ba, ba. Oh, I didn't die. I was looking at chat. Do be careful in chat, by the way. I see you guys talking about the series in general. Keep in mind, I'm going to be playing them all blind. Don't say anything in chat that could be a spoiler for future games. You will, uh, you will potentially get hit with the timeout if you do. All right, can you just kill that one, please? <laughs> okay, they're bulkier than I expected. That's fair. That's fair. Hit him with a hurricane. Boop. That did zero? Why'd that do zero? Hello? Hey, shoot that one. Take that. Take that. That did nine. All right, note to self. No more using physical moves ever. <laughs> Amber Turtles must be hit with magic. Duly noted. I love their attack animation. Probably kill that one like that. And then... Get that one. Get him out of here. Bum, 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 bum. Future chaos, close your eyes. Nice. I'll just do that. I'm kind of, I'm kind of like not even really reading chat at the moment. I'm just like barely skimming because I don't want to. I see that Wolfen did end up deleting some messages. I'm kind of only like half paying attention because I don't want someone to put something that'll be a spoiler. And then me see it. Hey. 
She's aiming at that one. Hit that one. Let's do it. Get him. Oh my goodness, that damage animation. I want an amble. Amble? I want an amber turtle. Alright, finish killing that one. Goodbye, my little friend. It was nice knowing you. I wish I had killed that one. Ow. All right, we, 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 this is gonna work, trust me. All right, not gonna work? Fire! Dead. 99 CP. Beautiful. I just realized that Olivier has over 300 EP. Excuse me? That's insane. I'm killing this one with physical moves, you can't stop me. There we go. That was actually easier than I thought. Yo, give me that experience. Let's go. Level 13. Or no, wait, no. Is that him leveling up to 14? I was half looking at chat again. Exterminated the monster on new Ansel Path. Let's go. So this is the North Shore of Valeria Lake, huh? It certainly seems peaceful and quiet around here. And doesn't look too shabby either. I stayed here once before when I was in the area on another job. The wine's great, the rooms are nice. Pretty much what you'd expect from a place like this. Too bad this isn't a pleasure trip. You mean it's not? I, at least, intended to toss my cares to the wind for a while. Taking cat naps in a rocking boat by day and filling my belly with food and wine by night. Heaven. This is what a vacation is all about. Haha, <laughs> come on everyone, I was just joking. We can enjoy vacation any time, but now is the only time we can enjoy taking care of some would-be thieves. You cannot just enjoy a vacation any time. Are you out of your mind? Even I, Olivier Lenheim, know enough to get my priorities straight. I don't think this has anything to do with enjoyment or not. Mm-hmm. Well, whatever. As long as he does his share of the work he's here to do. Anyway, let's see if we can find the old man staying here that loves fishing. The guest who said he saw some suspicious individuals here two nights ago, right? I forgot. We need to go back and get that, uh... I was so focused on the Ansel Path monster, I didn't realize I would be right into the Valeria Shore. But I didn't- Ah, oh, dang it. I didn't, uh, I had to talk to someone in the southern area about their missing jewelry or whatever. Bum, 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 bum. Dude, I hate that everyone has a hitbox. It's so annoying. It was actually, like, one of the most annoying game design things of all time. I really, really do not like it. Bow, bow. Trails is notorious for having quests you can miss in 10 minute time frames. Yeah, it seems a little lame. Seems fairly lame, but you know, whatever. Can't be as bad as Tales of was back in the day. Tales of side quests, like getting a hold of those, like before Berseria, they were usually nightmares. All right, who is the person I needed to talk to here? Stolen ring. It's quite valuable to me if anyone. Uh, I live on Bose's South Block. This is the South Block. Where are you living? Living over here? But still, I feel like I'm going insane without Trino being here in Bose. We've been fighting. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, yeah, business rival. What? I, I, I don't care. I don't care. Are you the one who lost the ring or not? Really hope the city will settle down soon. Stock market's cooling down. Yada, yada, yada. Who's the person who lost the dang ring? Wonder when I should tell my parents about wanting to enter the, war the Royal Academy. Unfortunately, right now, doesn't seem like a good time. Yeah, whatever. Don't live there. Live here. Hello? Anyone missing a ring in here? No, this is just the upstairs of the old couple. Oh, no, wait, no, this isn't the old couple. These are the other people. But you guys are also are not missing the ring. Who's missing the dang ring? I'm trying to keep up with chat. A lot of stuff happening in chat. Who the who the heck is living around here that's missing a ring? Up here? That go no, this goes to the whoops. No no no, not north block. This house right here? Hi, you missing a ring? 
Had a very important ring taken by them. I don't care if it's the Army or the Bracer Guild. I just want to see those burglars caught. These Sky Bandits are on the loose. I don't think I can live without being in fear every day. Wait, okay, well, what about your ring? Yeah, your very important ring was taken. Taken by him. You're not the one I... Is there someone else in here I need to talk to? Hi. Wonder if my dad will come home soon. Mom looks really upset about something. Yeah, she's missing her dang ring. Okay. Am I missing something here, chat? I guess, okay, so maybe I don't need to talk to the person. Maybe I just need to find the ring and then bring the ring to them. It said they lived on the south block, so I was like, oh, I need to go there and chat to them, but maybe I only need to talk to them if I find the ring. I thought they'd tell me, like, give me some info on where to find it, but I guess it's just the Sky Bandits at large, so probably just keep doing the main mission then, huh? Back to the lake! To do lake things. Ah, oh, you stupid hurricane. These things look like friggin' crawl, dude, I swear. Unidentifiable odor. I have identified it as being annoying. Goodbye. Whoop. Bum, 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 bum. How dare you spawn right in front of me? I have places to be, can you not tell? Wait, you guys gave good experience before, didn't you? I think these guys gave good experience. These are weak to fire? Yeah. Prepare to die. Can't touch this. Burn that one to death, Shara. Oh, is that the thing that cancels magic? I hate that. Magic canceling nonsense is annoying. Why does this dude have infinite EP? He's got so dang much. Burn. Nice. Easy murders. You know what? Kill a dead. Pick dirt wig when you go to the lake, obviously. It's the best start. Oh my goodness, that did so much. I don't even need to bother using magic to kill these things. We made a paper mache. Yo, we're gonna get to see Olivier's alt next fight. Nighty night. Nighty night. Okay, these are not the ones that gave good experience. What did I fight a little bit ago that gave good experience? Yo, it gave me fire sepit though. I am in desperate need of fire sepit. That alone is worth it. Got to be able to open up more of these dang core things. Hi. I thought I could interact with the sign. All right, someone around here is gonna tell me about these dang bandits. My mother and I come here every year on vacation around this time. It's a tradition in our family. My mother seems to look forward to it every time. I kind of feel bad for my father, though, as he always gets left behind. You leave your father behind? That's rude. The Kingfisher Inn in Bose and the Maple Leaf Inn in Zeiss are my favorite places to stay. Okay. What you got against your husband? Welcome to the Kingfisher Inn. Please let me know if you would like to stay. Well, no, I want to talk to a certain person. Hi, is it you? Welcome to the Kingfisher Inn. Are you all here to stay? Let's see. Yes and no. How should I put it? We're here looking for a certain someone. Is there a guest staying here who loves to fish? Well, pretty much everybody who stays, he stays here loves to fish. It's next to a lake, you morons. We heard he was a friend of the old man who stayed here yesterday. Do you have a clue who that might be? Oh, are you talking about old man Kuano? If you're talking about his fishing buddy, then I think you must mean Lloyd. Lloyd Irving from Tales of Symphonia? Lloyd. I've heard he's a professional angler who came all the way here from the Royal City. It seems as though he's a member of the Fisherman's Guild there. He sounds like a pretty amazing guy. Do you know where we might be able to find him? Haha, <laughs> he's out dropping a line somewhere, of course. If I remember right, he should be out on the back pier. Alright, out to the back pier we go then. Go out this back door. Whoop. Where you at, Lloyd? Talk to me. There's a boat here. Excuse me, Lloyd, where are you? 
What is the is the back pier over here? Ah, Lloyd, hello. Man with pole. Excuse me, are you the man named Lloyd who's from the Royal City? Wow, he's really focused. He's tuned everything out of his mind by fishing. He's thinking of nothing but fine dining and fishing and breathing. Looks like this is where my skills come into play. Push Olivier into the river, please. Or into the lake, rather. What are you? Just sit back and enjoy. Leaned over and with a smile that left all kinds of things up into interpretation, blew into the man's ear. All right, this is sexual assault. Throw this man in prison. Oh my goodness, what in the? Who are you kids? And where did you come from? That was a dirty trick to play on him, Olivier. Yeah, that was pretty low. How do you do this evening, good sir? We tried calling out to you a moment ago, but we could see that like a true professional. Your attention was fixed upon your task. You're Lloyd, aren't you? Yes, that's right. But how did you know my name? We heard from a certain old man about you. Do you have some time you can spare to speak with us? I see. So you heard from Mr. Kuano, did you? Yeah, I saw that strange pair about two nights ago. I knew it. Could he... Good words. Could we get you to fill us in a little more on the details? Before that, are you all bracers or something? Is this somehow related to some sort of crime? We can't say for sure, but there does appear to be a possibility. Gotcha. In that case, I'll do what I can to help you out. It was the other night when I was out fishing on my boat. I was returning to the inn, dead tired after a day of battling it out with the master of this lake. It had gotten late into the night, and it was about the time when everyone at the inn was asleep in their beds. Now hold on a minute. What do you mean by the master of this lake? I'm glad you asked. Obviously, he's talking about a fish. Why did you bring this up? Now he's going to go on about this fish. The master is a giant salmon that swims the murky depths of Valeria Lake. It has been the feared king of the waters among fishing lovers for over a decade. Now, how long do fish live for? Crap, I shouldn't have asked. Yeah, obviously, Shara. Looks like you've thrown a log onto the maniac's fire. Is it really that huge of a fish like you say? You bet your last mirror it is. I've been chasing the darn thing for the last five years of my life. How sad does your life have to be that you spend five years trying to catch an abnormally large salmon? It comes and goes in different parts of Valeria Lake and changes its feeding spots on a whim. I heard from a buddy of mine that it appeared in these parts, so I came a-running from the royal city. Ha! Now that's what I call passion. I can completely understand where you're coming from. Whenever I find something I like, I stop at nothing until I get a hold of it. For example, a bottle of Grand Chardonnay and such. In your case, steal it is more accurate. How about we get back to our story? So, Lloyd, what happened when you came back from fishing that night? All right. I had returned the boat and was on my way into the inn when I saw an odd couple head out to the road from the grounds behind the building. Onto the road in the middle of the night? Yep, no doubt about it. They headed out on the new Ansel path. At first, I thought they were a group of people visiting from the city heading back home but it was way too late for something like that, and when I asked at the inn the next day, nobody knew a thing about it. Thought maybe I'd seen a couple of ghosts or something then. Ghosts? There are ghosts that come out here? Ha, <laughs> just so you know, the two I saw were a young couple. They might have been two lost souls who committed a double suicide after not being accepted by those around them. Wow. Okay. All right, I guess. I mean, it's possible. You're not wrong, but wow, what a... What an assumption to make, brother. Aw, oh, don't tell me anymore. Oh, brother. A bracer that's afraid of ghosts? The guild is doomed. Not to mention her habit of always wanting to hear more ghost stories and other bizarre stuff. Uh-huh. Well, isn't your being scared attractive in its own right, Estelle? Not sexy, but cute nonetheless. Like a little kitten shivering in the cold. You'd better watch out because this little kitten bites! Ha <laughs> ha! Well, I was just kidding about the ghost part. But the couple did, in fact, seem to be one with a purpose and reason. I say this because the girl was wearing some rather odd clothing. What do you mean by that? I only saw her from behind, so I couldn't say for sure. But it looked to me like she was wearing some kind of school uniform. Oh, here we go. It's Josette playing her classic stealing prank. A school uniform. It couldn't be. It wasn't one from the Genis Royal Academy, was it? Wow, you really know your stuff, kid. You betcha. My niece goes there as well, and it looked exactly the same as the one she wears. I see. This whole event just got a lot more interesting. It's her. I know it's that lying tomboy for sure. We're finally onto her trail. What? So she's an acquaintance of yours? Then while you're at it, tell the two of them not to fret and rush into anything they'll regret later on. 
If my mind isn't failing me, I could have sworn they said something about coming again tonight. Is that true? Yep, we'll meet back here in two days, is what the young man said. His tone seemed rather serious, so I couldn't help but think on it. Well, that's understandable. We appreciate the valuable information. Just leave the rest up to us. We won't let them get into any more trouble than they already are. Oh, I see. That's a relief to hear. I feel like a weight's been lifted off my shoulders now. Now that is off my chest, I feel like taking a boat out and fishing again. Well, there's no time to lose. I'll leave you youngins to your work. All right, peace out, dude. Man, I don't even measure up when it comes to that fishing nut. He mentioned something about a fisherman's guild, too. I wonder what kind of group that is. So how is this couple involved with the missing airliner incident, exactly? If you don't mind telling me, that is. Well, in a nutshell, eh, yeah, explanation. I see. Well, that seems to be the person in question, all right. Which means that tonight is the night, huh? Yeah. It looks like we should probably get a room just in case. We're gonna be in for a late night tonight. All right, let's go ask the receptionist about a room. Let's get it. The time is nigh. These dang sky bandits. Hi, I would like to sleep. Thank you. 